The Vice President, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, has sworn into office the new governing board of the Bank of Ghana. The 13-member board is chaired by the Governor of the Central Bank, Dr. Enes Yedu Addison. The Vice President charged the new board to assist the bank to achieve price stability, growth of the financial sector, and bring down lending rates to propel economic growth. The Bank of Ghana is charged with the mandate of overseeing the overall performance of the financial sector, maintain macroeconomic stability, and put in place measures to stabilize the value of the city. It also acts as the banker and financial advisor to the government, ensures effective maintenance and management of Ghana's external financial services. These are the areas the new 13-member governing board is going to assist the bank to achieve. The board is chaired by the governor of the central bank, Dr. Ernest Yedu Addison, with his two deputies, Dr. Maxwell Opuku Afari and Dr. Johnson Isiama, as members. The others are Mr. Charles Edu Bwahin, Dr. Eugenia Ampofu, Mr. Kelly Gajapo, Dr. Kwame Owusu Nyantechi. The rest are Dr. Samoni Noi Ashon, Mr. Jude Kofi Bakno, Mr. Joseph Al Hassan, Mr. Andrew Boydo. Dr. Maria Hagan and Mrs. Comfort Okran. The Vice President, Dr. Mohamed Bamia, said the economic success of the government is partly dependent on the policies by the Bank of Ghana. He charged them to fashion out the right policies to support the government in that direction. The Bank of Ghana has been bringing the policy rates down and as we stabilize the macro economy, bring about fiscal consolidation better anchor inflationary expectations, um, then you will see stability in the currency and so on. Whilst we achieve that macroeconomic stability, we expect the decline in the policy rate to also be transmitted to lending rates in the country amongst the banks. Mm -hmm. um, we know that there are a lot of elements that go into the pricing of credit in this country. So I think this is going to be a major task for you to maintain macroeconomic stability uh, at the end of the day and also try to, to create the conditions which would allow the banks uh, to, to bring interest rates down sustainably. Mr. Andrew Boydo assured the Vice President of their readiness to support the government achieve economic objectives.